Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about clearing a mapped network drive cache on your Windows 10 computer. So this should be a pretty straightforward process here guys, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So all you need to know is the drive in which the mapped drive is on. So once you know that, we're going to go ahead and just copy a command I have in the description of the video and open up a notepad file. So I'm going to paste the command I'm going to have in the description of the video directly into this notepad file here. In my case, my drive is on the E drive, the drive that is mapped. However, in your case, it might be any other letter. So just don't think because it's E in my case, it's the E drive in your case. So just make sure you have that understanding. So just copy it in here. And then if you have to make any changes, you can. And then we're just going to go ahead and right click and copy on it again. And then open up the start menu, type in CMD. Best result should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Go ahead and copy the command I'm gonna have in the description of the video and then just paste it into the command prompt here. So just right click on the top bar of the command prompt window, select edit and then select paste to paste it in. So the reason it's not actually even recognized in my case, I do have a knee drive on here. It's because it's not actually a mapped network drive. So that's why, but pretty straightforward process here, guys, if you did have one, if you did actually have a network drive. So like I said, pretty straightforward. Do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.